In this video, I'm going to show you how to clean those rollers on your Roomba. You know, sometimes they get really dirty and you want to clean them. I'm going to show you how to take it apart and do it. Your review channel. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. It does help me out quite a bit. And let's get into the video. I'm going to show you how to do it. Coming in for this one. On this here, we're talking about the iRobot E6. And we're talking about how to clean the rollers, how to clean the uh, trash bin, and how to look at the actual mechanism itself and see how it actually functions. So we're going to turn it around. And we're going to take a look at this exactly. And I want you to see here what we have. So we have the two rollers. Now these rollers here are made out of like a rubber. And with these new rollers, the new technology is actually really, really good. So what this does, basically, it really does a nice job picking up pet hair, picking up all kinds of dirt. The older ones had bristles, and the bristles would get caught with dirt and, and especially hair. Um, <clears throat> so this one, the, the new design, really, really good. Also the sweep arm as well. Um, does a nice job. It runs a little fast. So it does push the dirt around a little bit. Um, so that is, it is what it is. Um, but it still does a good job of getting in the corners. Okay. And this is the trash bin right here. So open up the trash bin. You press this button here. And the trash bin just open right up, opens right up. And you can see here. There's actually some dirt in here from the last time. But we're going to do another uh, video on how to, on, on a carpet um, next. But let's just go through the first. We're going to do the cleaning. And a little bit of dirt in here from the last uh, time we used the Roomba. So we'll put that back in here. So that's how you clean it out. You take this and you just empty it out. Okay. So real simple. Here's a little filter in here. That's the filter. You change this filter if it gets clogged. And it does get dirty. It doesn't take too long. Really easy to change. You just pop it right out like that. You put the new one in. And that takes care of that. You can clean these out with a little vacuum. Use it a few different times. And you can order more online. I'll leave a, um, a link below where you can pick up the, uh, the vacuum itself. And also where you can pick up extra filters and things of that nature. Upside down. Okay, so back to the um, the rollers. So, so hopefully you can see clearly. So the best way to clean it is to take these rollers apart. The little button right here. You just lift this up here. Hopefully you can see that, and that opens up that mechanism there. Okay, and these rollers pretty much just come right out. Okay, real easy. Just wash them on the water. Take off. Sometimes the hair will get caught under here. Clean out all the hair that gets stuck in there. Clean out the hair that goes in here. Okay. Same thing with this one. Clean out the hair over here, underneath of these little rollers here. And you can get replacements of these as well. They're really easy to change, and really, really easy. They just pretty much pop right in. So basically you pop that one in there. And you pop this one in here when you're done cleaning it. All right. Then I get it right in the hole, okay? Then they fall right in like that. And then you just basically close the little latch, and that easy to clean these rollers out really really simple to clean these rollers okay and it's very very important I would say after maybe after a week or two you want to just go in there and make sure the rollers are clean make sure the under the barons under the situation like I showed you before make sure these here are clean over here it's really important and that way you get the maximum life out of your Roomba and you can also re get replacement bristles as well the sweeps you can get replacement um, the sweep arms the actual bristles you can change these are easy it's just one little one little screw okay so you can see that one little screw right there that's easy to change so everything is very easy to change everything is really really simple with the, with the Roomba it's got a nice nice quality built to it I want to take this time to thank you so much for watching this video please don't forget to like share and subscribe it does help me out quite a bit to support my channel it really does all right guys let's get back into the video well, I do appreciate you stopping by for this tutorial. I hope you learned how to change the rollers or to clean the rollers. I'll leave links below for new rollers, for new uh, whatever you need, filters, the sweep arm, whatever you need. I'll leave all the links below. Or if you're looking for a vacuum, this is a great vacuum. I'll also leave a link below for that as well. So I do appreciate your time. I hope you learned something. That's most important. Any questions or comments, leave below. And I'll get back to you with any answers that I have. I will give them to you. If I don't, if I don't know it, I'll find out for you. All right, guys. That's it for me. Don't forget, it's easy to change the rollers. It's so simple, and I appreciate your time. And don't forget, I'll see you at the next review.